Keep it clean. It's freelancer in the building. What's up, baby? Shout out to my guy Derek Harvey, by the way. Now, um, do y'all remember in school, uh, or for those of you who are still in school, um, when the teacher, the teacher would go down the list of everybody's names. They would do roll call, and if you were there in the classroom, you would have to say present or here. That's exactly what's happening with the Ravens. And the Jets for Odell Beckham Jr., his workout that he's having today in Arizona, I believe. The Ravens are present, and the Jets are here, well, there. Um, and they are attending the workout today. Now, if we know anything about these Ravens, Ravens are a team that's, they are going to check all the boxes. And what I mean when I say that, they are going to attend whatever workout they are going to show themselves, um, they're going to get all the information on any player that's available because they, they do it all the time. Um, they do it to significant players. They do it to, I don't want to say not so significant players, but I, or maybe I should say they do it with prominent players and maybe not so prominent players, but they do it with everybody. They, 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 they do their background checks. They, they get all the information that they possibly can, and they do their research and their homework to find out, all right, what's this player looking like? And just in case we are very interested we could possibly make a move if it even gets to that point. So the fact that they are there at Odell Beckham Jr.'s work, his workout is cool. Um, it doesn't really make me think, all right, well, now this is the Ravens are definitely going to sign him. I do think it's a real possibility that they do, especially depending on the uh, the, the price, his price. Cause we know that's uh, that's the name of the game right there. I mean, look look at what's going on right now with contract negotiations with a certain somebody. It's all about price. But anyway, um, with Todd Munkin having worked with Odell Beckham Jr. before them having a, a relationship, um, and with the Ravens talking about wanting to redo the wide receiver room this year, uh, Odell Beckham Jr. is a real possibility. And he's coming off of an injury. He missed the entire season last year. So right now, he's sort of down. There's a lot of doubt cast around Odell Beckham Jr. And the Ravens, they like stuff like that. They like players that are doubted. They like players that seem to be getting overlooked a bit. Um, they like players that have dealt with their fair share of injuries and whatnot. Uh, is, 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 uh, I think Odell is over 30, right? So him being a wide receiver, and if he's over 30, they like that. Too. But anyway, I'm, I'm just messing around. But uh, what they do like it, though. Um, so, yeah, it's, it's cool that the Ravens are there. Um, and we'll see if anything comes to uh, fruition when it comes to the Ravens and Odell Beckham Jr. Because, again, the Jets are a real possibility as well. Um, and the Jets, especially with it looking like they're going to get Aaron Rodgers, um, if they do get him, then if it's between the Jets and the Ravens, and I'm not saying it is, but with them being the, the, the teams that are there, we'll just use them as an example. Um, if I'm Odell Beckham Jr., and I'm looking at this situation with the Ravens and Lamar Jackson, and really any free agents, especially at the wide receiver position, they're looking at this situation, there's so much uncertainty there. And I know a lot of stuff is making it look like the Ravens are going to keep Lamar Jackson, but it's still we just really don't know yet. We've heard reports and this and that. Well, we just really don't know yet. So any free agent, especially on the offensive side of the ball, they could be looking at the situation like, man, I don't know who that quarterback is going to be. I don't know who's going to be throwing the ball off to me or handing the ball off to me. I, I just don't know. So, you know, I'm going to stay away from that. Uh, but if the Jets get Aaron Rodgers, then they'll obviously know who their quarterback is and they'll have certainty at that position. So uh, it'll give other teams an advantage with stuff like that. So, But, again, with the whole Lamar thing, it's – who knows how long it's going to take to play itself out. Um, but it, it literally impacts everything that the Ravens do. Um, but again, shout out to the Ravens for always doing their due diligence on wh whatever player um, that comes available, uh, that comes about and that comes up. I love y'all team. Keep it clean. And this freelancer is out.